Hello everyone and welcome back to the cozy chair and can I just say happy Valentine's Day! I love Valentine's Day but you probably already know that. I have a lot of Valentine's Day books already on the channel. In the past years I have read Loved Ruby Valentine and I've loved a Frankenstein Valentine that one is so silly and this year I read Happy Valentine's Day Mouse. Today I have a really fun story about a little old lady. Oh, there was an old lady who swallowed a fly. Do you remember her? I don't know why she swallowed that fly. She's always swallowing silly things. Well this time she's not swallowing a fly or even a spider to wriggle and jiggle and tickle inside her. Today this is the story of, oh, there was an old lady who swallowed a rose. What? You're right, a rose. And this book is by Lucille Calandro and it's illustrated by Jared Lee. And this book is published by Scholastic. So let's find out what this silly old woman is doing. When she's swallowing a rose. There was an old lady who swallowed a rose. I don't know why she swallowed the rose, but that's how it goes. There was an old lady who swallowed some lace. She didn't race to swallow the lace. She swallowed the lace to tie to the rose. I don't know why she swallowed the rose, but that's how it goes. Hmm. There was an old lady who swallowed some glitter. She wasn't a quitter to swallow the glitter. She swallowed the glitter to trim the lace. She swallowed the lace to tie to the rose. I don't know why she swallowed the rose, but that's how it goes. Hmm, what do you think she'll swallow next? Hmm, I guess we'll see. There was an old lady who swallowed some candy. Ah, I do that sometimes. It was fine and dandy to swallow that candy. Do you swallow candy? Sometimes. You better chew it up first. She swallowed the candy to garnish the glitter. She swallowed the glitter to trim up the lace. She swallowed the lace to tie to the rose. I don't know why she swallowed the rose, but that's how it goes. Hmm. What do you think she'll swallow next? Do you have an idea? Oh no, I just showed you the back. A jewel. Let's see if that's what it is. There was an old lady who swallowed a jewel. We were right there. She wasn't a fool to swallow that jewel. She swallowed that jewel to brighten the candy. She swallowed the candy to garnish the glitter. She swallowed the glitter to trim the lace. She swallowed the lace to tie the rose. I don't know why she swallowed the rose, but that's how it goes. Let's see what she's up to next. There was an old lady who swallowed some hearts. She showed her smarts by swallowing those hearts. Up, 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 up. She swallowed the hearts to surround the jewel. She swallowed the jewel to brighten the candy. Oh, not that one. She swallowed the candy to garnish the glitter. She swallowed the glitter to trim the lace. She swallowed the lace to tie to the rose. I don't know why she swallowed the rose, but that's how it goes. There was an old lady who swallowed a card. It wasn't hard to swallow the card. Well, maybe for her, but it would be for me. It brought the old lady so much happiness that she smiled and laughed and, oh, what will she do now? Blew a big kiss. <sighs> Look at all that stuff that came out when she blew a kiss. The rose and the lace and the candy and the hearts and the jewel. All to say, happy Valentine's Day. Love, the little old lady. Happy Valentine's Day. Well, her message is the same as my message. Happy Valentine's Day. Now, I'm just curious how many of you like to make Valentine's do you like to make Valentine's? Well, I was thinking that maybe if we had time on the cozy chair, 
I could teach you how to make some valentines. If you think that's a fun idea, then comment down below. And if there's a lot of people that want to make valentines, then we'll do a special show on the cozy chair about how to make fun valentines. Thanks so much for coming and make sure to come back because I have more Valentine's books. Thanks so much and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.